Gibbs on 44. Boucher on strike. Oh, and there's a bouncer, and there's a big appeal for court behind, and he's given him out. Given him out too. That's a beautiful delivery. Very fast ball. Boucher going for the hook shot. There was obviously a little deflection there. Perhaps it was the glove. See if the replay tells the story. It'll be interesting to see here exactly what height the ball went through. I think Mark Boucher is quite interested to see what height that ball went through. It's interesting one. I, I suppose the, the question one would ask is, when he hit it, was it shoulder height? And, uh, well, if it had it continued its path, it, just looking there, it probably would have been above the shoulder height. So really, a little bit unlucky, I think, is probably the way to describe that dismissal. 14 of 26 balls. South Africa now 74 for two. Hickenstein, the new batsman. Showbacked up. Oh, and a Yorker first ball. Fast delivery as well. 150.7. Right, let's have a look at this one again. A contentious decision, this one. Let's see if we can pick up. But before we do that, let's have a look at this uh, this delivery. Was it uh, slipping down the leg side? Bit of reverse swing there. Just nipping down the leg side. Good ball, though. The key here is to watch exactly what height the ball is once it gets to Mark Boucher. Is it above shoulder height in normal standing position? Oh, pretty good call by the umpire, I would say. Uh, it's very hard from square on at 150 kilometers an hour to judge that perfectly. Oh, it's clean bowling. That's beautiful bowling. Benkenstein really just inside that one a little bit. It looked as if it came back from outside off stump. That's Mr. Benkenstein. Well, he wouldn't enjoy that one too much, I'm sure. No one likes to see their son get bowled out. However, it happens to all dads from time to time, no doubt. The Pakistanis are loving this. That was a good delivery. Came back from just outside off stump and just nicked the stumps. Have a look. See that little bit of uh, movement back there? Just beat the outside edge. He was uh, on the crease a little bit. Perhaps would have been a little bit more positive with that defensive shot. Good bowling, though. Shower back there gets another wicket. South Africa, 74 for three. On strike. Well, bowled right up there in the block hole again. Klusner on the back of a bit of a bad run. Needs some runs. Maybe he saw the 144 a little bit better than the 122 from Venkates Prasad the other day. Certainly South Africa needs Lance Klusner to get some runs here now. This is the delivery. Good length. I think the key here was the length from Shaya Bakhtar. Stay down a little bit. Uh, but that's the sort of length on this wicket that's been really difficult to get away. Yes, uh, you're right. That did stay down a little bit. And you can see by his reaction there. And certainly that uh, replay from sideways on showed that. Right, there's one ball to go. Klusner on strike. He's had a few problems with his groin, hasn't he, Shara? That, that right, Klusner's on strike. Two slips in position, tearing away again. Oh, bowling, bowling, beautiful delivery, magnificent bowling, Shara Dakta. Absolutely spot on target and furiously fast. He's brought this place alive. Not easy. You let these Pakistanis get a few wickets. Once again, the length here is very, very good. I mean, that's the same length that got Dale Benkenstein early on. Good reaction uh, there, and uh, well, look at that over. Three wickets in the over. Lance Klusner out for the for a duck. 74 for four. Wonderful over, and there was a little bit of swing in there as well. 